All week long, we've been shining the spotlight on Wilmore. And tonight, we're taking a look at a business that's been serving the community for more than 65 years. It's just incredible. We're talking about Fitch's IGA, the local grocery store in town. Evening Edition's Angie Bevan joins us live now for more on our Spotlights on Wilmore series. Hey, Angie. Hey, Larry and Nancy. Well, this IGA here in downtown Wilmore is run by Leonard Fitch, and it's been here for decades now. And of course, it's your typical grocery store that people visit every day. They also have a deli that Leonard runs that is really popular for breakfast and lunch. But this place is about more than just food or a meal. It's all about community. Well, you have a good time. Oh, you too. Leonard Fitch still pretty much does it all. He may get around a little differently than he did 65 years ago, but. Hello. Even at 83, his motivation to keep doing it. We want to have quality product available all the time. Remains the same. I want to do something for, for my neighbors and friends, and, and, and I enjoy them so much. He enjoys the community Fitch's IGA has helped provide all these years. Being a grocer is in his blood. Since 1836, they've been grocers, <laughs> one generation to the other. Leonard's mom and dad started an IGA in New York and then moved the business and the family to Wilmore when he was a child. We were from upstate New York. My mother and dad moved here with six children with the intent of us to go, going to Asbury, which most of us did. Leonard had a literal hand in building the current Fitch's IGA location. This particular building we built ourselves. I did a lot of, the, I even jackhammered. <laughs> Creating a place where people come to do their typical grocery shopping. And in the back, there's a deli. <laughs> called Leonard's Kitchen. That's pot pie, this is fresh fried chicken. We got potatoes, broccoli, green beans. I do fry the chicken every day. Cooking and serving food to customers for breakfast and lunch. Okay, what would you like on it? It's a popular spot around lunchtime in Wilmore to grab a bite to eat, but people also show up early. They come in at seven in the morning and they're sitting in this area we're sitting in and visit and uh, just feel feel really neat. It feels like community. Really appreciate it. Thank you. The whole reason Leonard and generations before him started this in the first place. We, we want to be the friendliest place. And his motivation after 65 years. We do all we can to make it that way. To keep moving forward. Okay, thank you so much. And although they have been here in this location for decades now, prior to breaking ground here, they were just around the corner on Main Street. And Leonard hopes that they carry on this business for years to come. Live in Wilmore, Angie Bevan, Evening Edition.